Oh, hello, rise and shine, little vampire. How are you feeling? Does your body still hurt because of the transformation? Oh, you spent so many hours agonizing in the pain while you were turning into a vampire. It got a little boring after five hours of you screaming and thrashing around. I almost thought you wouldn't make it, you know. You sure took your sweet time. <laughs> of course, the first thing that comes out of your mouth after finally waking up is an offense towards me. Ah, oh, it's good to have you back, love. <laughs> Where are you? Well, of course, in one of my mansions. In the dungeon of one of my mansions, more specifically. I brought you here while you were turning. <laughs> I know you probably aren't happy with the cell and the chains around you, but it is necessary. I knew you would try to escape as soon as you opened your pretty little eyes, so I had to make sure that that wouldn't happen. I can't have my little sweethearts roaming around in the streets, can I? Besides, it's day right now. If you tried to go out, you would burn into ashes. Hmm. I do like a little of pain, but not at that level. I imagine you do feel the same, even if you do like it rough. <laughs> uh, hmm. You want to know how long I plan uh, to keep you trapped in here? Why do you want to know? Hmm. Oh, is it because you can't wait to wrap your arms around my super hot body? <laughs> I bet it is. Oh, more like wrap your hands around my neck. Oh, darling, I can work with that, no problem. <laughs> Anywho, I'm going to keep you here until you start to behave for me. I can't show you off to the other vampires if you're not nice and obedient, after all. I only have one rule for the people I turn. Obey me. At all times, whatever I tell you to do, you can't question it. You just smile and do it. Because I'm well aware that you're quite unruly. So while you're here, I'll be training you and working on convincing you to obey me. <laughs> hmm. I can already picture it. It will be so fun to tame you. After you're trained, I'll let you get out of here. You still will be under my consistent supervision until I fully trust you. But it sure is better than to be trapped in here. <laughs> Don't you agree, love? Uh, did you just call me an ugly psycho? <laughs> I'm not ugly. I was the most handsome man in my village when I was a human. And after I was turned, I was the most handsome man on my creator's castle. Hmm. <sighs> and about the psycho part, oh, people have called me worse, so you have to step up your game, darling. <laughs> <laughs> oh, please. You still don't understand the situation you're in? Love, you're not a monster hunter anymore. You are the monster. You're my darling now. My sweet pet, my honey, mine. Your days of hunting are over. From now on, you just kill to feed yourself, or when I tell you to kill. The sooner you accept that, the better for you. And as I said, you're not getting out of the cell until you behave how I want you to behave. Yes, yes, sure. You're going to regret this. I'm going to make you pay for this. Everyone says the same things. So boring. Now, shut up and let me ask you something. Are you thirsty? You must be starving, right? <laughs> Don't worry, I have something for you. <laughs> a blood bag. Fresh blood straight from a human's vein is much better. But I don't think you deserve that yet. So I got you this instead. Drink it. That is the first order I'm giving you. You won't 
Ugh. Um, I was expecting you to refuse, sure, but it still annoys me all the same. But I won't be a good partner for you, so I'll try again. <clears throat> My darling, could you please drink this blood bag I got for you? It's for your own good, I promise you. Oh, gods, you're so frustrating and so stubborn and impossible. I even said please. I never said please to anyone before you, and you still won't comply. <laughs> um, do you really think you can starve yourself to death? Uh, vampires can't die of starvation. The only thing that will happen to you if you don't feed is you'll start to lose your mind because of the thirst. You'll go feral and then one way or another, you'll end up drinking the blood I gave you because you'll be so out of your mind that you won't even think about trying to resist it. Actually, you won't think about anything at all. A monster's hunger and will always speak louder, my dear. But you don't care, do you? You don't believe what I'm saying, so you're going to try it anyway. I'm sorry, love, but I refuse to let you starve. I don't want to see your beautiful self turn into a completely savage beast. You don't know how unsightly something like that can be. I hate unsightly and unattractive things. Um, what am I going to do? <laughs> well, <laughs> feed you myself, of course. Now, isn't that so romantic? Hmm. Now, open your mouth. Open your mouth right now. Ah, that's it. Here, drink it. Drink everything. That's it. That's it. Um... <laughs> Now that you finally tasted blood, you don't seem eager to resist. Hmm? <laughs> uh, I told you, your hunger will always win the battle, every time, for all eternity. Oh, don't you dare call me disgusting. You're the one who drank the entire blood bag and even made a mess all over your clothes on the floor. You're as disgusting as me. And <laughs> the perfect match, wouldn't you agree? Yes, I forced you to drink it, but only in the beginning. After that, you took the bag of yourself and uh, drank it until the very last drop. Hmm. <sighs> Leave you alone? Why? I like seeing you all covered in blood. I told you that before. It makes me excited. Let me enjoy the view. Hmm. <laughs> Okay, okay, no need to throw the empty blood bag at me. I'm almost done here, I'll leave you soon. For now, that is. Oh, you're all dirty. So, I'll need to bring some water to you and some clean clothes. Or, do you want to spend the rest of the day like this? <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought, sweetie. Hmm, I must say, I'm impressed with how strong you are. You are able to take the blood bag from my hands, even though you're all chained up like this. Of course, you're still not stronger than me, so don't even think about trying anything stupid. But, you're probably stronger than vampires that are around for decades. It's rare, but sometimes it happens that a newborn vampire is stronger than the older ones. Uh, don't let it get to your head, though. I'm the only one allowed to be cocky around here. Ah, <laughs> oh, you have no sense of humor. Always making these faces at me, as if I'm saying something stupid. Uh, you better start smiling and laughing more if you want to get out of here faster. If you smile for me right now, I'll bring you more blood. I may even bring you a human so you can taste fresh blood. 
It's so much better than blood bags. <laughs> what? Well, fuck you too, asshole. I'm tired of your insolence. Come here right now. What? What is it, hmm? Are you mad that I'm grabbing you by the hair? Are you mad that you can't do anything against me? Or are you actually turned on, you freak? Hmm. Something deep inside tells me that you'll like this. You like the things I do to you. You like me. I know. I know you do. You like me, and soon, very soon, you love me. <laughs> oh, shut up. Don't say you hate me. It's not true. Shut up and give me a little kiss. That's my second order for you. You can't deny me. You don't have a choice. You're mine, so I can kiss you if I want. Whenever and wherever I want. Mm -hmm. You're mine. Mm -hmm. Mine and only mine. Mm -hmm. Mine. Oh, you just bite my lips? Damn it. <sighs> of course you did. That's so like you. I forgot that's how you like to do things. Let's get even now, shall we? Mm. How do you like that? It's not nice when you're in the receiving end, is it? But then again, that's what you probably enjoy, right? Relax, love. I'll do to you everything you enjoy. But are you too shy to tell me? Is that why you provoke me so much? You want me to be more aggressive? But you're so shy to ask for it? Hmm. Yeah, of course, that's it. That's why you say you hate me. You don't actually hate me. You just want me to be more dominant. Now that makes sense. Now I understand. Oh gods, you're so cute. <laughs> don't worry, darling. We'll have so much fun while you're here, I promise. Oh, poor thing. You really think you have a choice? You say you're never going to be submitting to me, but I told you to drink the blood bag I gave you, and you did. I told you to kiss me, and even though you didn't pretend you didn't want to, we kissed. Think about it. Even if you don't want to submit to me, do you really have a choice? Maybe you're already a slave to all my wants, and you just don't know it yet. Maybe you do know, and you just don't want to admit it. Anyway, I'll go away now. You need some alone time to reflect about your bad behavior. I'll be back again in some hours. Oh, you didn't smile for me, but I did get a kiss in the end. So I'll bring you more blood. Bye, my love. Don't miss me too much. Oh, yes, yes. You hate me? Sure. Love you too, little vampire. <laughs>